signs you might have an evil person in your life. Hey there, so have you ever felt like someone in your life might be, well, evil? It sounds intense, I know, but it's important to recognize when someone's behavior is harmful. Evil people can be really good at hiding their true intentions, making it hard to spot them. But don't worry, I'm here to help you understand some signs that could indicate you're dealing with someone wicked. Number 1. Everything always revolves around them. Do you know someone who always makes everything about themselves? Like they never listen to you or care about your feelings. That's a big sign of a malevolent person. They're super self-centered and think they're better than everyone else. It can feel like you're always in their shadow with your needs and opinions being ignored. Number 2. You constantly feel manipulated. Ever feel like someone is always trying to control you or make you do things you don't want to do? That's manipulation and it's a common tactic of evil people. They use guilt, sympathy or flattery to get what they want without caring how it affects you. It's like they're always pulling the strings behind the scenes. Number 3. There's a consistent trend of dishonesty. Evil people are often really good at lying and deceiving others. They twist the truth to make themselves look good or to blame others for their own mistakes. If someone close to you is always lying or breaking your trust, be careful around them. Number 4. You can never really predict their next move. Do you feel like someone is always up to something sneaky? Evil people are good at planning and scheming to get what they want. They enjoy manipulating situations and people to benefit themselves. If you feel like you can't trust someone's intentions, it might be a red flag. Number 5. There's a clear absence of remorse. It's really concerning when someone doesn't feel bad about hurting others. Evil people often lack empathy and don't show remorse for their actions. If someone keeps hurting you without feeling sorry, it's not a good sign. Number 6. You feel isolated because of them. Have you ever felt like someone is trying to keep you away from your friends and family? Evil people might try to isolate you so they have more control over you. It's important to have a support system outside of this person to stay safe. Number 7. Your boundaries are disregarded. Do you feel like someone is always crossing your boundaries and invading your personal space? Evil people often don't respect other people's autonomy and try to control them. It's important to set boundaries and stick to them. Number 8. You are intimidated or bullied by them. Feeling scared or threatened by someone is a major warning sign. Evil people might use fear to control others and make them feel small. It's important to recognize this behavior and seek help if you feel unsafe. Number 9. You frequently catch them taking pleasure in the misfortune of others. Have you noticed someone enjoying when others are going through tough times? This lack of compassion and empathy is a big red flag. It's not normal to feel happy when others are suffering. Number 10. You can never please them. Do you feel like you're always trying to make someone happy? But nothing you do is ever good enough. Evil people are often never satisfied and always want more. It's like trying to fill a never-ending void of expectations. If someone in your life makes you feel scared, manipulated or bad about yourself, it's important to recognize these signs and seek help if needed. Trust your instincts and take protective steps for yourself. Start setting firmer boundaries or limiting contact if possible. Reach out to a friend or counselor you trust and get the help of authorities if needed for your safety. With support, you can shield yourself from an evil person's harmful influence. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like and do share it with your friends and subscribe to channel as well. Thank you for watching.